you must be alarmed. I would be too. You see, I'm not Neil. Not exactly. Not exactly? What, what do you mean by that? I'm a result of Neil's endeavors. Mo. I'm from the future. Listen, we're living on borrowed time, so I will get straight to the point. The Neil you know now, presently, he must be very dangerous. On the brink of insanity? In the future, he will snap. He gets that contraption off his foot, eventually. Turns out he's a mechanic, and a pretty good one too. See, he creates tools. Weapons that alter the space-time continuum. Well, at first he did. Then he began studying genetics. Mo, I'm Neil's clone. His, his clone? You're kidding me. I don't joke. Not anymore. My future will be very grim if you don't take what I'm telling you seriously. Your future will be grim. After being severely wounded, Neil, the one you know now, feared his inevitable death. So he created a clone of himself. Me. But enough of this background information. I'm here to talk to you. I need you to do something for me. Whoa, wait, wait, wait a minute. I, I didn't sign up for this. Well, See, I thought you'd say something like that. Mo, truthfully, you don't even have a choice. What do you mean by that? You see? Well, Neil, he... He kills you. I'm sorry I had to tell you that now, but I'm happy to say that there's a way that we can prevent that, to prevent everything. There's a chance I'll survive? I'll do anything. I'll do anything if it means saving my life. Something happens to Neil while he's trapped. If I remember correctly, he suffered a near-death injury. I suspect this is what makes him crack. Your job needs to kill him before this happens. Kill him with what? My bare hands? Not quite. Is this, is this not a joke? Please be serious. The weapon I'm holding in my hand was designed and created by yours truly. It makes up for its heinous design with its deadly features. This type of pistol will automatically vanish after the trigger is pulled. How will, how will I get back? I don't want to get trapped in that room forever. Sorry, I must have forgotten. The key is below the alarm clock on Neil's pillow. Oh, and I forgot to mention, make sure you drop the pistol immediately after you used it. Otherwise, it'll take your hand with it. Ready? Mo, no, 
No! No!